One of the more common questions I get is, you know, what are the most important factors to consider with ballistics and long range shooting as far as putting your rounds on target? Like what are the big reasons that, that people miss? I would say probably the number one thing is range. You know, you have to have a good range to your target because your bullet is dropping and in order to hit the target where you want to, you have to correct for bullet drop is the primary thing that you're going to correct for and that drop is most proportional to range. Okay, so once you have the range, you can either, you know, you can estimate a range using the mill formula and a scope reticle if you're, if you're practiced and good at that. Uh, preferable is a laser range finder. You know, get a good laser range to the target and, you know, you'll be within a couple yards and range, you've taken that out of the equation now. After range, the next most important variable in long range shooting is definitely the wind. Okay, the wind, uh, after three or four or 500 yards, uh, the wind is going to have enough influence to move your shots off the target if you don't correct for it. And the best way to account for the wind is to measure it at your location with a Kestrel. The Kestrel can give you the speed and direction of the wind at your location, which can baseline your wind call for your long range shot. The wind isn't always blowing the same downrange as it is at your location, but by measuring the wind at your location with a Kestrel, you can get a good baseline. Um, now, the trouble with the wind is that it's always changing, so you want to pay close attention to the wind when you're measuring it, and then the time between then and taking your shot, if it changes, you have to account for that. If you get an accurate range to the target and a good wind correction, you'll be able to center your group on target at long range with great success. Uh, there's other things that come into play, you know, spin drift and Coriolis effect, the, the effects of atmospherics and knowing your muzzle velocity. So there's a long list and you can read about those things in the Applied Ballistics books that are written in layman's terms for long range shooters to understand and apply. But if you're just looking for like, what are the top most important things? It's range and wind.